Column 30. Request helicopter at uh, Admiralty Way at 14th. Under the bank. Two suspects. Proceed with plan. Look at the strike team. Wait. Do not enter bank. Picked up some extra help. Two male Caucasians. Delay any action until they leave the bank. We don't want to shoot out in here. Stacy, Kirk, give them the money. We'll take them outside. the name for it, baby. Get your hands up. Everybody, shut up and stand still. You two lovers over there, move! Get in the corner, now! Everybody, stand still or we'll blow holes in you. Get your hands up, now! Everybody, you over there, get out of the corner, now! Come on, move! Get out of the corner, now! Everybody, get your hands up. Did you hear me over there? Get your Please hands up, now! Me. What's the matter over here? Get your hands Drop up! Your money. Come on, move, baby! Cool. 
Let them take the money and leave. Remember me, honey? No, I, I mean... Oh, yeah, you remember me. I did a whole number on you. We're going to clean this place out. And when we do, that means I might have a lot of money to spend. Want to come along for kicks? All right, knock it off! Keep your eyes open, damn it. Shut up! How come my application's on top? What's going on? Nothing. It's just routine. I... The references in it didn't check out. We have to report things like that to the manager. Little Miss Cool with all the answers, right, honey? I don't remember you being here the other day. Let me see your purse. I want to see what you carry around. And hand it over real nice and slow. Talk to Catalina Luis's sister. All right, she works here in the house. First door at the top of the stairs. My name is Zucker. I'd like to have a word with Catalina. Who sent you? Detective Miguel Gomez. Why didn't you tell me? My brother says you're a man who likes to learn for himself. <laughs> Here. I just learned. I'm going to do this my way. I'm bad. My way. <laughs> Bingo. Yeah. That was Sergeant Hooker, United States. Which one of you is Catalina? <laughs> I am Catalina. Your brother Luis and Detective Gomez said you had some information that could help me. Nothing more? I'm trying to track some stolen jewels that were smuggled in from the States. You told your brother you'd heard something about them? You must be mistaken, senor. Catalina. You're afraid. What is it? I can't say. I'm sorry. You're not afraid of Detective Gomez, are you? <laughs> Miguel? No, senorita. He's afraid of Miguel. Then what is it? Why won't you help me? Please, just leave. Catalina. When I mentioned the jewels just now, you, you got very quiet. I don't care about the jewels. But the man who stole them and smuggled them here, he also took a little boy he had no right to take. And there's a chance that something bad might happen to that little boy if I don't get to him quickly. Please, help me. I have this friend, Amparo. She spends much time at the Hacienda of Senor Madera. She told me she heard the senor speak of buying many diamonds and other jewels. That's good enough. That's all I know. Many thanks. And I'll tell Detective Gomez that you helped me.
Where to, my friend? To the hacienda of someone named Madera. Senor Hidalgo Madera. He's a very powerful man in the city. He's also a dealer in stolen jewelry. He could lead us to the boy. It may be, but unfortunately, I don't even have grounds on which to question this Madera. When I go back to my city, the boy's mother and father are going to be waiting for me. I'm not going to give them a speech on jurisdiction and red tape. I'm going to give them a boy. My son were missing. You'd be the first man I'd ask to find him, all right? Now, this Madera, it's not just rich, it's dangerous. What you say is true. This Burke is equally dangerous. In which case, you might need this. Gracias, amigo. Of course, if you get caught with that, regretfully, I will have to say it was stolen from you. Of course. And put you in jail. Of course. Cindy, come here. Give me your hand. For just a moment, Cindy. Daddy. Just, just, just. I, I don't want you to fall. Cindy, believe in me. I, Cindy. I can do this. I, I can fly. Cindy, let me help you. Why don't you believe in me? I can float. I can, I can fly. Give me your hand. I don't want you to fall. I can't fall. Come on, Cindy. Like take his hand. Fly. Be a good girl. Come fly. on. I can do Cindy. this. I can fly. Cindy. I can, I can be. Listen, Daddy. listen to me talk, Cindy. Don't get excited. They know I can fly. They believe in me. Honey, you believe in me, Daddy. I believe in you, Cindy. Your dad has always believed in you. No! 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 Excuse me. Coming through. Coming through. What about the other students? Any witnesses as to how she got the stuff? They couldn't or wouldn't tell me anything. Could be they're just afraid, don't want to get involved. And while they're not getting involved, another kid like Cindy is buying a ticket to hell. Becoming another scrambled mind with a question mark for a future. Every chance I get, I'm gonna come down on a scum that deal this poison. Hit him hard. Make it hurt. Romano, call for a backup. Boy, I'm sorry. Officer needs assistance. Officer in foot pursuit. Maintaining foot pursuit of rape suspect, northbound down Oakmont.
Drop the knife, Pendleton! Get my Romano. You're left to kill me to take me. I'm not gonna kill you, animal. There's only one way to keep your kind of scum off the streets. It's a public trial. That way everyone will know what you are. <laughs> Thank you. 